I want to line everything up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to connect everything. That to that, this to that, to that. I want to connect everything to the main body. Um, I guess a good shortcut for that would be you select everything and then uh, unhighlight the body and just drag everything to that. What I'm going to do with that is I'm going to make sure that this is zeroed out on the Y axis, which puts everything right on that center line there. And I'm going to move this up, which means that it will no longer match with the reference panels as far as placement. Um, but I don't care because we can do what we want. I'm just going to freestyle the tail as if that's some kind of big feat. Ooh, the tail. Um, a neat trick I might have showed you before is, uh, is if you lose, let's say, uh, say we alt Q solos things, uh, See, like in this viewport, the um, the left viewport here, we don't see the head at all, do we? We can hit Z on the keyboard, and that brings it up in every panel. Which is good. In case you get lost. Like, if I exit this now, and I go to rotate it, see how that's off-center? Uh, we just hit... Well, we could hit the home button here, which will bring it back to home access point, the grid. It will align to that, or I'll turn the grid off. I could just hit Z on the keyboard, and it brings everything back. Okay, so I'm going to create the tail now. I'm just going to... Oh no, I forgot to zero everything out. Okay, so I want to make sure that uh, everything is right. You don't even have to do this. This is just uh, my OCD acting up. I always have to do this. Like you can make it a little messy. It doesn't matter really with this this specific time. Now, if I take this and I make sure that's zeroed. It is, that's zeroed, that's zeroed. These, you make sure offset at the right amount. We'll just make this a uh, 49, which means this will be negative 49. Oh, 49 there, that's right. Um, maybe two. Will that be too much? No, that's fine, which means we can go with positive 2 here. And since they're mirrored images, you don't need to adjust the other things. I guess we can move this up to 21, 22, 21.5. Uh, we'll do the same with this. I like the numbers to be like that, 21.5. Also, maybe slide the nose in a bit. There we go. And create a sphere on the butt here. That can be 15, that's fine. Orient properly. Now we'll leave it like this for now. Shift drag that out. We'll make this radius point four, uh, point five. Point five is good. cylinder will rotate into position uh, 
we can leave this at two so there's one slice in the middle there slide that into this change the height control or shift drag that I'll make this radius 0.2 eh, 0.3 is fine 0.3 and we could also lower the size values on these we can make it like 10 we can make it 8 8 is good Eight and uh, I just will make these edible polys. And R on the keyboard again is the shortcut. I don't know if any of you guys understand my problem here. See, when I when I roll over this part, it's supposed to be the universal scale. It's not working for me. I don't know why that is. Damn, that's really weird. This is a new occurrence, by the way. So to learn how to work around that. So one of you viewers out there can help me with that. Uh, all right. So we'll have to keep doing it this way, I guess. Man, that's bizarre as shit. Oh. So anyway, that's... <laughs> this is going to be our shitty tale. That's really weird. I don't know what's doing that. There be some kind of setting that I've checked or shortcut I missed up or something I don't know